from VOA Learning English. This is the Education Report. It was not just another day in a classroom recently for some young people in Washington, D.C. These student volunteers visited the Smithsonian National Museum of Natural History to test a new program. Some students explored the mysteries of human bones. Other students examined an insect under a microscope. The student volunteers were among the first to help test a new exhibit, a new showing at the museum. The program has an unusual name, spoken as curious, and written as Q question mark R I U S. The exhibits are designed so young people can learn about science by taking part in experiments. The program combines the newest technologies and scientific equipment with more than 6,000 museum objects, both real and digital. Students from local schools help develop the exhibit, which combines science and art. Teachers will bring their science students to the exhibit in the mornings. In the afternoons, the exhibits will be open to everyone. Many of the students already have their favorite activities at the center. 13-year-old Nate said he liked exploring the containers with dinosaur bones. Addie is 12 years old. She liked the bee display. She found that the bumblebee and the yellow bumblebee were very different when she examined them under a microscope. Another student Ben said he enjoyed an exhibit that lets people use their senses to learn. He said, for example, that a butterfly smells a little like tea. Involving the senses, smell, touch, hearing, is one of the exhibit's major goals. Curious can also be found online. For VOA Learning English, I'm Laurel Bowman.